Alex Lawrence Barkley here at AutoSense Detroit. I'm here with Hal from Tetraview. Hal, welcome to AutoSense. Thank you. Tell us about Tetraview. You're new to us at AutoSense, but you've been around for a while. Uh, we have. Uh, the company was founded uh, seven or eight years ago uh, around the core technology that we have uh, here showing today, uh, but not focused on the automotive application uh, until about uh, six to nine months ago. And tell us about that technology. What have you got? So uh, it's a high-definition LiDAR technology that uses high-definition sensors, so standard CMOS image sensors in a uh, high-definition high 2-megapixel format and a flash LiDAR, so you get full motion video, 30 frames per second, in high definition uh, as a result of the approach that we take. What we're doing is using diode laser to illuminate the field of view uh, in a very short pulse, and then we are capturing the entire image, two megapixels, so high resolution image, and capturing range information all during that single flash, so we get 60 million points per second uh, out of this as compared to a few hundred thousand that the standard approach of, of using a single spot to scan around uh, uh, generates. We have two main outputs of this. Uh, we have uh, high resolution uh, video and range information on every single pixel as a result of the approach that we take. So everybody's talking about solid state LiDAR obviously and cameras are fairly well established in the sector already. Um, and the, the main conversation is the price point. So what, do you, what price point are you looking at when you're talking about the, the sort of volumes that OEMs are going to be looking at? Uh, we're confident that we can get this into the price points that the OEMs are looking for. Uh, everything in the camera is uh, commercially available now. Uh, we do some customization of it, but there's no fundamental technology that we need that isn't already in high volume, so uh, the, the, the cost will hit the points that our customers are looking for. Uh, we do have the components in plentiful supply. Uh, we do need to see volumes get up to, to hit the targets of the industry, but, but everybody does. And fundamentally, uh, we're designing around things that are very cost effective, which is what gives us confidence we'll hit those targets. Great, Hal, thank you so much for your time, and we really look forward to seeing you again next time. Thank you.